Hey guys, I'm back with another GoPro tips and tricks video. In this video, I'm going to be unboxing the RAM um, A size socket arm with one for one inch ball. So this is the smallest socket arm that they make for their um, one inch ball mounting systems. And if we open it up here, you can see that it is quite a bit smaller than the standard size B arm which are the medium size uh, socket arm that comes with uh, most of their accessories. So this is if you really want to just keep it low profile. Um, I'm thinking of using this with the suction cup mount. So I can just stick this on here. And then my camera can be kept very, very close to my suction cup mount. That will cut down on weight, it will cut down on vibration. Um, lots of good things like that when it's not kept, um, that arm doesn't have that leverage to, to make the camera vibrate. So great little, little tiny mount like that. Um, that's a lot smaller than if we we're using the medium sized arm or the long arm. Uh, yeah, so that's the size A. That is the Ram socket arm B-ball size A the length. So that's the smallest um, arm they make for the one inch ball. And I think it's very versatile and it definitely adds a little bit more flexibility to your GoPro or to your RAM mounting system, having something a little bit smaller than just these size of um, socket arms. Kind of like the small extender bars in the GoPro. They're really good for some things and then the long ones are really good for other things. So it's nice to have that balance between both of them. Thank you guys for watching this another GoPro tips and tricks video. If you've enjoyed it, please make sure you subscribe. Check out my channel for lots more videos and like the video. If you've got any questions or comments, please make sure you leave them below and I will get back to you. I read every single comment that's posted on my channel. But if you really need a response, right now I may not be able to get back to you. YouTube's done some funny things with their comment system and it's making it hard for me to respond. Uh, the best thing you can do if you want a response is check out the Facebook page in the video description, the YouTube Tips Facebook page and post your comments there. If you leave them in the on, my, on the page there, leave them on the wall, I will respond to those um, a lot quicker than my YouTube comments. It's easier for me to sort through them there and look at everything and see what I've responded to. So guys, thanks for watching. 